You can spot a man having a midlife crisis a mile off. They suddenly try to pull off fashion statements only teenagers can get away with. So when cops spotted this middle-aged idiot in a restaurant parking lot, at first they thought he had unsuccessfully attempted the new fashionable street way of wearing your jeans. <laughs> All the kids are doing it now. Doesn't quite work when you're 40, though. You look more like a baboon in trousers. Put it down the grass right now. Walk. 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 See, they keep falling off me. Sit down. Turn around and sit down. Do you not listen? Yeah. Time to hold my pants up. Pull your pants up. My thought comes to them off, do what you have to do to get your pants off. No, I just went to the store and I was walking home. I ain't driving. Put your pants up. Pull them up. Stay down and just pull them up. You don't have to stand up. It's wet. Actually, he's got a point. Who are these? The fashion police? I mean, if Mick Jagger can prance around on stage in a G-string at 60-odd, what's wrong with a fat bloke who's in his 40s showing a bit of backside? You've never driven past a building site. You got your ID on you, sir? Yeah. Yeah, let me get that real quick. What's, uh, what's going on today? Me? Yeah, what's, uh, what's the story? I just walked down and got a couple beers. Where do you live? Right down the street here. OK. Just a little old make dinner. I'm not a rush in the area. I love the fact that this bloke can't see that he's done anything wrong. But unfortunately, despite his pleas for equal trouser-wearing rights, this poor chap's arrested on a public decency charge and taken to the station where he was given a good dressing down. In Orlando, Florida, Orange County deputies are escorting a delightful young lady into the police drunk tank. No! Over here. No! Drunk tanks are where the police take chronic inebriates and paralytic partygoers to cool off. But it would seem drinking is not the only thing this young woman does for kicks. This police officer wants to read her her rights, but she's not interested in hearing any of it. You have been arrested and charged with driving while under the influence. I wasn't driving. I wasn't driving. I wasn't driving a fucking vehicle. Get it straight, baby. What is your name? Get it straight. I wasn't driving shit. Get it straight. Break. I'll straighten your ass up. This charming young woman is clearly starting to endear herself to these officers. I know the fucking system. I know the fucking system. You ain't gonna put your shit on me, bitch. 1994. Fuck you. 94? That's my date of birth. 72. Smoking with a joint, honey. Shit. She might be as drunk as a skunk, but she still kicks like a yeah, mule. Y'all can fucking accept I'm fucking kicked. Y'all don't know shit. Y'all fucking fucked up. You wanna listen to me? I don't get on fucking what you say. Fuck you. Oh. Fuck you. 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 Fuck Half of us hide in our rooms, spotty and scared, and the other half get drunk and then arrested, like this chap. This is never a good thing, because it means that inevitably your mum is going to have to come and get you, and she's not going to be happy. This little tyke decides that it's not the way he wants to go. He's going down in a blaze of glory. But he's drunk and he misses the door by a good three feet. Well, maybe this will be the lesson he needed, because you can be sure he's going to have one hell of a headache in the morning. And just to be sure he's truly got the message, the friendly cops reward his escape with a firm rogering.